In this video, 16 by 2 LCD is interfaced with 80 mega 8 microcontroller and is programmed in C to display text and numbers. In this circuit diagram, we have the LCD interface with the 80 mega 8 microcontroller where the four data lines are interface with digital lines PD4 to PD7 of the microcontroller and we have the enable line connected to PD0 and the register select connected to PD1. We also have a 10K pot connected to analog input 0 of the microcontroller. In this demonstration we see text displayed on the LCD and a number count. We also see the pot value and when the value equals 1023 the display demo is repeated. The programming of the LCD is based on the assembly code I presented in a previous video, where the LCD was interfaced with Arduino. A link to that video is available in the video description. In this video, the assembly code is rewritten in C, where the 80 mega ports are directly programmed to enable the interface of the LCD. Some assembly code is reused, namely delay subroutines. We begin the sketch by declaring these text arrays, which will contain the text that will be displayed on the LCD. Inside the setup function, we set port D as output, and then we set pins PB0 and PB1 as output pins for the enable line and for the register select line. Next, we put a low pulse on the enable pin, and then we apply some delay to give time for the LCD to power on. Next, we call this function to initialize the LCD. Inside function LCD initialization, we will call this uh, subroutine or function in order to send multiple command bytes used to initialize the LCD. So we begin by sending hexabytes 33 and 32 in order to initialize the LCD for 4 bit data. And then we send the command byte 28 so that we have LCD two lines. And then we send the command byte 0C so that the display is on and the cursor is off and then we send command byte 01 to clear the LCD and then we send command byte 06 in order to shift the cursor to the right. Inside function command right we will receive the command byte and then we will mask the command byte and retain the high nibble and then send it to port D. And then we will put the RS line to low in order to program the LCD in command mode and then we will send the enable pulse. Next we mask the command byte but this time we retain the low nibble and then send it to port D and then we send the enable pulse. Function data write is similar to function command write but instead of sending a command byte we are sending a data byte to the LCD and also we have to make sure that the RS line is high so that we have data mode. After we initialize the LCD Within the loop function and using this while loop, we will display text1 on the first line of LCD. Next, we send this command byte so that the cursor is at line 2, position 0. And then using this while loop, we will display text2. Next, we send this command byte to clear the LCD. And then use this while loop to display text3 on line 1. Next, we use this for loop to display count from 0 to 20. Now we send this command byte so that the cursor is on line 2, position 0. And then using this while loop, we will display text 4. Next, we use this do while loop to display the pot value, which is between 0 and 1023. And when the pot value reaches 1023, we will exit the loop and then clear the display and repeat the process. In my next video, I will program DHT11 sensor in C to display temperature and humidity on LCD. 
Thank you for watching.